Hello everyone. Let's provide the solution to this problem. Okay, so we have 3 root x equal to 2 root 2. Okay, so what is the first thing to be done? The first thing to be done is to square both sides. And this is equal to 2 root 2, both squared, right? So that's from here, we are going to have 3 squared multiplied by square root of x squared. Then on the right hand side, we'll have 2 squared multiplied by square root of 2 squared. Now, 3 squared is 9. Multiply by this and this will go so we have x and this is equal to 4 Multiply by this will cancel this and we have 2 To continue with this We are going to have 9x being equal to 8 And we can simply divide both sides by 9, right? So we have divide by 9 divide this by 9 so that 9 will cancel itself and x will be equal to 8 over 9. So this is the value of x. And we can actually put this back into the equation and then we'll confirm what we are having. Okay, so the original equation is, let me fix it here. The original equation is 2, okay, it's actually 3 root x equal to 2 root 2 okay this is the original equation and our x is now 8 over 9 so that means we are going to be having 3 into okay the square root of 8 over 9 then being equal to 2 root 2 so I'm going to work on this and see if I'm going to have 2 root 2, right? Now, this is 3 multiplied by square root of 8 over 9 is the same as 3. I mean, square root of 9 is the same as 3. Now, this can cancel this. Meaning that on the left-hand side, I'm having just square root of 8. And this can be broken into 4 times 2. Square root of 4 is 2, so we have 2 root 2. And this is what we had on the right hand side. So this is to confirm that our 8 over 9 is very correct as the value of x.